Hey, what's up guys? I hope you all are having a wonderful day so far. So in today's video on how to go from zero to hundred thousand dollars using an AI web agency business model. Uh, this is episode 13, scaling your agency. So once you actually have your first few clients in your own country, I would definitely recommend just start scaling your business so it works for you, not just you working on your business as a one man show. <clears throat> So firstly, let me just make this a bit smaller. So firstly, we'll go over different ways of marketing, uh, specifically running ads to your landing page and using this uh, and how to use the same domain for it. And I'll just show you how to build a landing page quickly for it as well. Then hiring a team to outsource website building to focus more on what brings you actually money and hiring a team to get more leads and custom service, uh, well, and to handle the custom service, and then just basically going international to get higher paying customers. You'll mainly be doing that through, well, advertising and also cold calls. Let me quickly just, uh, let's get started with the first thing. So different ways of marketing. Uh, once you get your first few clients, most likely through just calls and emails and just out, outreaching by most likely going to the businesses near you that doesn't have a website and stuff like that, then um, it should be, well, I would definitely recommend that you uh, start running ads to a landing page. Let me quickly show you how to build a landing page for it. So if you just go into your account, um, well, here, this one is our own, uh, well, our website. If you go over to funnels just here on the side and you click on new funnel, let's quickly just wait for it. And you'll see there's lots of different funnels. Uh, let's see agency. Um, which one, which one? Well, any one of these, um, I would recommend focusing, well, just checking out the free website, guys. This is basically a funnel, as you can see. There's no options here at the top. That's the difference between a funnel and a website. A website has, like, this is a website. I just want to show you of all these different things that you can do and check out. Uh, a funnel basically just takes your customers from point A to point B, whatever you want them to do. As you can see, it's only apply into, well, apply, apply. There's only apply buttons. There's nothing else. At the end, at the very bottom, there's maybe a few links and stuff, but they basically just want you to apply. Um, I definitely recommend that you check out this website, the free website, guys. They are killing it. They have, well, you can use a, a traffic uh, checker, uh, one of those apps like SimilarWeb, to check their traffic. They get about 200,000 traffic a month. Uh, obviously, they are getting a lot of clients for free, or a lot of clients. And it's the same way that, I, well, they are basically doing the exact same thing that I tell you guys, what, what I tell you guys to do. They will build a web, well, design for you for free, and then they charge you a, uh, well, a monthly retainer. They have other options too. If you go here in the bottom, um, ad additional services. just want to show you, like, they actually charge quite a well, Just the domain is $100. Uh, lead gen just to set up um, just your basic website. Uh, well, just the lead gen is 150 and all these like hourly work, $50 an hour, the custom website, $3,000. As you can see, they charge quite a lot, but they get all their, their just their basic leads just from, from their, just this specific funnel. And then they charge subscriptions. And I would suggest you do the same. You can also charge them a once off fee. Uh, on the, on Aerify specifically, if you've, if you have noticed, I just want to show you. On the pro plan, you can host up to three websites now. It's not just, uh, well, this one is just for, well, one website. So you can host three websites. So that's basically $20 a month. If you charge whatever you, ch uh, whatever you charge for a monthly subscription or a monthly um, or maintenance fee or whatever, that can basically just cover that $20 and you can host up to three. So it's very easy to be profitable with this. And then obviously you can continue from there on. Um, and you can also just, uh, well, if someone wants the a full package service, like all the automations, rep reputation management, all those types of things, then obviously they just need their own account. Um, but most of the time, especially in the beginning, they would just like a, well, just a plain website without any of the additional things. Then um, you can have three of them on, well, on this pro plan and basically just, well, offer them websites. And uh, later on, you can also start upselling them different services and stuff. So to build a landing page, you just go there. Um, well, any one of these, let's just check. There's most likely more. Let's just search marketing, uh, digital marketing agency, digital marketing. Well, any one of these. And then let's, let's just web design, web design, downsell. Um, let's just check one of these. Obviously, you'll be editing it uh, just while well, adding your logo and just changing the words a bit. And then I recommend that you guys just basically follow the same principles that they have. 
just well you, you can use this text just add it well put it in chat gpt or use airify's ai just just to basically change the text for you um let's just quickly check that out my internet connection might be it well there we go it's done then you basically just add your um well just add your logo at the top and then all the buttons i recommend that all the buttons should go to a form and then that form to just get their information then you can literally call them and you can um well you can call them email them whatever you want to do and then you actually already have a very well uh a client that's really interested in a website and pretty easy easy to sell and that well if you run ads to it you can basically out well automate this process and get a lot of leads then just well i wouldn't recommend having prices on there since you're offering it for free um but that's basically you can just go and play around here and just make a nice uh well a nice uh what do you call a nice landing page for uh for uh getting clients so then the next thing i would recommend as soon as you get a few clients even most likely even before running ads i would recommend that you hire let me just check that you hire someone to start well just to handle the entire website building process of this business model and you can basically just let uh, well hire them you don't really have to pay them that much in time obviously you can then um you you just let them go through this entire course let them practice a bit so they can actually create nice websites for your clients and then you can um well once you have outsourced the website building process you can basically just focus more on getting clients and that same person can also well if they're on building websites at the time if you don't have clients yet they can basically from the, the entire day uh, from nine to five they can basically just be going and reaching out to clients for you you can even give them commission if you want then you don't have to pay them a salary uh let's say like 20 percent of, of what of whatever customer they of well if they get a customer 20 percent of whatever the customer pays or whatever you want to do it's your business at the end of the day um, well you can do that if you don't want to pay them a salary and then they can basically just be reaching out to as many clients as possible because if you go and well just do cold calling and, and blasting emails literally the entire day from nine to five you'll be well you'll be able to reach a lot of different clients and be getting a lot of different clients so you'll be um well getting a lot of sales and you'll be really profitable and if you charge them a monthly retainer you can build a massive portfolio of clients that you actually manage so um, i would definitely recommend as soon as you get a few sales get someone to help you then the business can work for you not you just on the business and then uh you can outsource while well, just have them handle the customer service and in uh, well handling the website building and just getting more leads so the next step of scaling is definitely going international as you well as i just showed you on this well the free website guys they charge quite a lot for their uh, monthly i think their basic monthly retainer is about 60 dollars a month um and well that's just the first package there's obviously more upsells and stuff um but if you and they are targeting worldwide with this specific landing page uh, you've probably already seen this landing page um so i would definitely recommend that you start going internationally you can go international by registering registering a company in the us uk well any country but i recommend one of those and then well you can well in the us you can get a company by going to jumpstart filings that's what i did then i registered in delaware jumpstart filings um, but the cheaper option well that's for america but it does at the end of the day it doesn't really matter if you go us or uk because you just need a stripe account because if you have a stripe account then you can basically target any country um uh, let me just show you get started i think i, I believe it's 400 dollars, but then you are good to go but uh, you can also go uh, i think it is let me just seed formations it's in the uk it's a lot cheaper i think it's 89 uh, one of my friends recently here we go this one seed formations i think it's 89 pounds if i remember, for a non-citizen there we go that one and then you'll have to get a wise bank account with jumpstart you get a bank account for that 400 dollars um but yeah you get a that's 89 dollars. then you get a, a virtual address you get a i believe you get a, a phone number um and you get the well your company registered then you'll have to pay wise i think it's 75 pound to get your bank account so it's still a lot cheaper than the us 
And uh, well, even before this, you can still just use PayPal to get custom, well, just to target, well, get customers internationally. But I would definitely recommend that you first get a few clients in your local market, in your own currency, and then later on going internationally and really scaling this business. And then, well, if you start running, getting, well, running ads like the, well, like the free website guys, they are probably getting between 50 to 100 clients a day because uh, they're well, they are running very high, um, well, pretty big advertising budget. So they get quite a lot of customers. But you don't have to really um, compete with them. There's millions of businesses that doesn't have websites. In your area, there's lots of businesses. If you just search businesses near me, you'll see most of them don't have websites. You can literally, uh, you can go to them in person if you want to. You can call them, you can email them. It's, it's uh, there's, and if you, well, if someone says no, don't give up too quickly. Uh, just get, well, get, get, just continue getting more clients, doing more calls, doing more outreaching. Because at the end of the day, it is a numbers game. So that's it for just, well, scaling your, um, well, your advert, your company. I will be showing you how to set up Facebook ads and all those things in a later video. And then, yeah, thank you very much for watching. I hope you guys have a wonderful day further.